right, what's up, yens guys? Time for another video. And um, yeah, I just saw in the morning news. Uh, you don't think people would learn from the other stories you see on the news of this? All right, another dude gets caught uh, in a store licking ice cream and putting it back. You know, taking the lid off, and licking it, and putting it back. Well, geez, there was a couple other ones I think like a year ago, and I think I saw on Google couple other ones that were like two years or more ago that it's happened in I guess other places that made the internet news or if you google it you'll see other ones that it's not an uncommon thing anymore so many of that you don't they don't even make the news and the ones that make the news it kind of makes you cringe like holy shit people get away with that the funny thing is all these stories you fucking hear um already somebody has the gall to do it again what the fuck do they think there's fucking cameras in there like, you're not going to get caught? Well, anyway, this uh, one dude, uh, they get him, and he's like, uh, they give him 30 days in jail. He gets a month in jail, $1,000 fine, and somehow I think if I have to go back and reread it, if I'm not mistaken, the version of the story I'm hearing, he uh, has to pay restitution to the ice cream company or something. Correct me if I'm wrong. I could go back and look. They got him for... Uh, couple grand in restitution, which the fine alone, if you're making a fucking minimum wage job, what are they going to do to make you keep paying that, you know, uh, garnish your wages or, I don't know, uh, what the fuck they do, but place where there's cameras all over the place and they do the same thing that's already made the news and thinking, oh, they're not going to get caught. Whoa, Jesus, uh, in my Walmart, okay, they have monitors and a lot more, uh, of the halls now, you know, the aisles in the store, and you go to the automated checkouts now, they have like a screen right here, you walk right into it, and it's facial recognition, very super high resolution, wave to it, and uh, I never want to use those at first, because um, I didn't want to get accused, say something, something don't get on there, and start to say I stole something, but as long as you beep, count your shit real carefully, you're okay, uh, what I do, I even show my receipts, I go like this, um, and I make sure everything beeps, and I make sure they see the camera, I'm counting, see, I bought a couple of jars of spaghetti sauce, okay, I make sure the camera, they see me, one, two, three, counting on the screen, you know, make sure it beeps, so I don't really worry about that, but, but anyway, my point is, uh, you got high resolution cameras all over the place, and imagine the ones that, uh, you don't see, they can, they can see the, uh, if you have a dime in your hand, they can see the damn date of the dime. Um, on the fucking uh, camera now. They're that good. And uh, you scratch your ass or scratch your balls somewhere they can see, or you're picking your nose somewhere. You know, but why the fuck do people do that? They, don't they know they, uh, it's the fucking 21st century? I think you're going to just get away with that. And I know when I did um, the uh, Salvation Army Kettle Drive, uh, you know, for toys for the kids and for the poor, you know, uh, when I have time for that in the winter months, you know, to do that, I go into Walmart and that. That's one thing, too. i got to be extra careful, too, because I don't want to unwittingly do anything stupid or say, um, as it is, I don't want to be, say, on the phone, texting the girlfriend on the phone or about something on the list or talking on the phone and accidentally. <laughs> that would be uh, terrible as it is. Never happened, but that's something you don't imagine. It's probably innocently happened not paying attention to what you're doing and head toward the door, you know, especially when you were involved in a charity. And plus you're known from that because everybody that works at that Walmart that you see at the door and say you accidentally do something, you know, they're going to, none of them are going to have any respect for you anymore. Or if they find out you willfully did any stealing or willfully did things like licking ice cream or doing all kind of shit like that, you know what I mean? And, Especially when you got a ponytail, too, you know what I mean? Uh, you got to prove that, yeah, yeah, you're not like one of those other people out there, you know. They think, you know, somebody who got a ponytail or got dreads would do something like that, you know. But, eh, I'm just being silly, but I just can't believe these people that, after you're seeing the stories about people getting caught, people or some other asshole, dumb asshole, some stupid... 
retarded dumbass goes and does the same thing again. Like what? A, and po oh, oh yeah, he posted on social media too. Yeah, that's what I forgot. Yeah, posted on social media too. I mean, can you believe it? You know?